Assalamu alaikum and greetings, Alishan Mo here. Welcome back to more gadget reviews. Today in this video, I'm going to introduce you a 3500 milliwatt laser engraver, a compact desktop laser engraver sitting right here on my table. It's that compact that I installed it right here because I needed a USB connection straight to my computer. It is very, very easy right outside the box right outside the box it's very easy to put together you just have to put x and y axis together using four bolts and after that start using it right away by downloading the software and the driver let me bring the camera closer and show it to you and show you what kept me busy all day long today before we go ahead please hit that subscribe button and don't forget to hit that little bell icon so you're stay updated for all the upcoming uploads let's take a look at this cool little compact laser engraver that also has a CNC upgrade coming so this can be a compact desktop CNC machine for you people right here for now I have a 3500 milliwatt laser installed on it and I have been busy carving my logos and you know coolest pictures on various things let me show you what I have been doing Right, now that you have seen how it comes in the box and how easy it was to put together, well, as I said, just bolt the four screws right here, and after that you're ready to rock. Don't forget to connect the cables, okay? Uh, there's one cable right here that you have to connect for the motor, and one right here for the laser, and you're all set to go. After that, you have to download the software. Well, before that, let me just turn it on, all right? Right here, and then you double-click on the software. It starts connecting okay it's very easy to use software basically uh, I can actually record the screen as well but I uh, just wanted to show you the very very quick how to start there's a tutorial right here okay you can also go on the tutorial and see how to install everything download the software it's basically 150 millimeter by 150 millimeter print size okay and how to start is stuff like that okay after that you have a photo gallery so you can basically uh, you know choose whatever photo you want for example I'm, I'm, I'm just gonna go down and say I want a tiger a nice tiger hold on I right there okay I, I actually printed this after that you pull the uh, corners I mean cropping you do the cropping as much as you want from the picture okay and say okay after that you can adjust the height of it you can you know change those if you like then go ahead and choose what type of carving you want okay for instance this after that you can rotate flip or reverse the images say okay and you're good to go you can basically uh, have one moment let me put one piece of uh, thing right here so now you have to align the laser head okay so I'm just gonna click on this icon right here so basically it will align it shows me oh actually I put the cardboard right at very nice place okay after that you stop it okay and basically you can set the laser focus okay laser focus is very very important you don't want it to be blurry you want it to be sharp and pointy okay right and after that well 
all you need to do is set the laser power so I'm just gonna set it to 60 or uh, let's say 50% started with that and then you set the burning speed I'm gonna set it to 20 milliseconds I don't know it's a meter per second or millisecond cannot be 20 meter per second right so I'm gonna set it to 20 ms okay and after that you say play and there you go your laser starts right away okay it starts covering uh, if you see it's too strong, uh, if the laser is too strong, on the go, you can adjust the laser power, okay? So I'm just going to put it to 40%. On the go, you can adjust the speed. I'm going to put it to 10 ms, okay? And you can see how the speed is changing. And there you go, it's, it's actually carving. Okay, while it's carving, I can show you what I've been doing. I did a paper cut, which is uh, in my previous laser engraver video, somebody asked if you can cut the paper. Well, that one I didn't know, but this one does cut the paper. Check it out. One moment, let me focus it. Sweet. You can see how well it actually has cut the paper. I did a big one as well, as you can see right here, this dragon, right? You can see. This is a beautiful cut right here. All right, not only cut, but you can also do the wood engraving. So I made myself a keychain. Okay, check it out. That's here, and the logo that I mean the dra I mean the tiger that we are actually engraving on that one is right here as well. Check it out. It has very nice engraving details, basically very very nice engraving details. So that's that. I got myself a keychain. I also went ahead and tried it on my wife's phone, the old phone, and it actually engraved a logo nicely on this phone casing. Basically, it does a very good job. I had to cut down the laser power because I was worried that it will just, you know, <laughs> go ahead and burn the battery as well. So, uh, cut down the laser power to 40% and I did a very, very good job uh, engraving the case here, phone case. Just I made a mistake, I put it upside down basically. Otherwise, it would have looked really nice. Apart from that, the best thing that I believe I did was this, uh, is that laser engraving the logo on this uh, mini crawler right here. You can see I have my Ali Shanno logo on top. On the front, this coolest skull. Man, this looks simply awesome. So now my crawler, my little rock crawler has a very very personal touch right here sweet looking really really good so basically this laser engraver is doing a very very good job since morning I'm busy engraving many many items so you want to put your logos you want to customize your products uh, you want to brand your products you know you want to do things with the plastic with the wood with the paper this thing is gonna do the job and imagine and imagine that once the CNC upgrade comes out you will have a CNC compact CNC machine right there on your desktop right now you can see it has a 3500 milliwatt laser basically you can change you can switch this laser to 7000 milliwatt laser unit which I'm thinking I believe is available from the same manufacturer so you can switch the laser and get it more powerful okay now this is not it if you want to do some more custom stuff what you can do is download an app and the scanner app all right and you have to scan a QR code let me just do it okay go to the control and there's a QR code and all you need to do is on your phone you scan the code and you have connected and you have a connection successful after that you can choose a picture from your photos okay whatever you want for example my logo um, this uh, quadcopter right here uh, my uh, carrot halwa um, my my kids with the plants basically whatever picture you want to choose you can choose from here or you can basically take a picture all right so let us take a picture hold on smile okay so we got the picture all right 
and um, we can just uh, crop it as we want otherwise just go complete picture go ahead and say upload all right wait for it okay once the upload is done you will get the picture in your software and now you can go ahead and crop as you like all right so i'm gonna crop my picture just like this all right and say okay and that is your size now you can adjust the size as you want okay and after that go ahead say okay and now you can choose which one you want basically these are those artistic type okay you can choose either those or you know just the outlines but you can also go for full image so i'm just gonna go ahead with this uh, medium detail one okay and now you can rotate flip after that you are ready to carve this picture anywhere you want you want to put that on a uh, on a piece of wood you want to put that on your RC you want to put that on the back of your cell phone case you can basically do it right away Wow, what a superb finish right here. Now, I can actually turn it into a little wooden keychain. Check this out. What a sweet finish it is. And the, the amount of details it's printing, uh, engraving right here on the wood. Man, that is simply amazing. Alright, this logo is finished, but I made a mistake. I printed it upside down. However, still, check this out. It looks so good on this phone. Okay, I just found this little crawler, which I have to review. It's a very nice four-wheel drive scaled crawler, mini 124 scale. I have two places, top and the bonnet right here, that I can engrave something custom. Check this out. It's carving my logo. I can smell the plastic burning. Uh, I have to put down the laser power to 30%. I have started with 50% power. laser engraver is carving you can also see details uh, the red marking means it has done that area and remaining is in black it's doing it line by line it's also showing the laser temperature right here this is going to look sweet on my crawler shell crawler with this laser engraved shell oh man this is customization this is your customization right there looks amazing I mean this laser engraver is doing amazing job it's nice it's fast and the details it's carving with is just simply amazing hmm what am I gonna do next is cutting the paper let's do it
you know what to do. Hit that like button. It's right there. I know you can do it. Oh, while you're at it, also hit the subscribe button. Right there. Come on, don't be shy. Just hit it. Thank you very much for all your support towards my work. That I post regular and fresh content on my channel just for you. Hit that like button. Right there.